I need all of you in the best of health. Um, on a normal, I do not release my course outlines onto after payment. But in order to avoid the lot and lot of misunderstanding I've been having in my DMs, <laughs> yeah, with prospective clients and students, we do not do the same things with the so-called organic bleaching people. Like, it's so unfortunate that that part of cosmetics has eaten so deep into us in Africa. Honestly, because I've um, been contacted um from people that are even outside nigeria so it's so unfortunate that that other projection of mix mix and all that is what is in vogue for real initially i was getting angry but i realized that okay that's my this is your field this is your expertise why don't you educate people? and of course that's the whole sole reason of even this youtube channel if you look at um 80 to 90 percent of the videos on this youtube channel is surrounding beauty cosmetics makeup you know and even a little bit of lifestyle and a little bit of vlogs as well but basically if you come onto the channel you will know that this has to do with cosmetics for both skin and hair even though my hair videos are not that much that much but it is what it is so um in no particular order um i would list i had a video though where i did them um, the, what they're not being told about um cosmetics um and I called the list of courses, or I listed the list of courses that we offer, but I will still do it again. I even dropped the list of some of these courses on my community. Maybe when you scroll down, you will see it. But mind you, the fees can still be subject to change. So it's not the one that you say, yeah, I saw it so so amount here. Yeah, it could still be subject to change. Okay. Um we offer courses, skincare courses. This I'm talking about skincare after skincare we will now go into hair care in skincare courses we have black soap that is black soap formulation where you're taught how to make black soap in a friendly way then we have scrub formulation course we also have acne slash hyperpigmentation course we have facial product course um, we also have emulsion course that's cream making and then we have handmade soap cold process now this is on the basic for skincare so each of these courses I listed to you, they have course outlines, what is expected. Because when I drop this um, list for some people, they tell me they don't understand. Some that understand, we now demand for course outlines, which I tell them I do not release my course outlines until after payment. But at this point, let me put it in a video. So when they said I should send it to them, I can forward the video for them to watch. Is that not so? prospective student and which i really understand initially i wasn't understanding but i get nobody wants to waste their money any longer of course people realize that there's something real out there but they don't know how to get it and to be honest with you going out to get it is not written on the faces of this so-called people that claim that they're educators or they're cosmetic uh people too much of my talking okay i'm going to start with facial product uh, formulation course and in the uh, course outline we have definition of facial products um we also have uh, uh what is ph in the course outline and then we also have topics on stabilizers solubilizers and adjusters then last but not least we have practicals with videos and voice notes so what is expected of you to learn on facial products course we have facial cleansers this is a facial cleanser basically what does a facial cleanser do most of the time it helps you to balance the ph of your skin basically so facial cleansers are things i recommend for people with uh problem with had a half problem with their skin barrier ish like that so this is why then the next one you learn are facial toners now there you will get to know the difference between facial cleansers and facial toners yes you will now get to know the difference is a facial toner yeah they look alike obviously when you look at their um physical characteristics but there are some internal characteristics that strikes the difference exactly and they are all hydrating products yeah they also help to hydrate the skin like on this one i even have an ingredient list on it we have water we have rose water we have licorice extract we have 
pantanol, we have vegetable glycerin, we have hyaluronic acid, we have phenoseethanol, we have disodium EDTA, we have citric acid. Okay, the next um, products you learn in facial product courses are facial creams. Yeah, creams for face. This is one of my products. This is a facial cream. Yes, and then another product you get to learn how to make is your face wash watch my videos my skincare routine videos all of the products i use are products from my products line no caps seriously um then the next one and under face washes we have uh face washes with surfactant obviously and then we have surfactant potency course there you learn the dynamics of um, surfactant you don't just pick up any surfactant to make facial products with because the face is a very sensitive place so you look out for um friendly foaming products that would not strip out the skin so either um the person has a dry skin or an oily skin or a combination skin the face washes should not strip their skin like personally because of the weather now dusty and all that i wash my face like twice in a day and i'm not having issues with my skin barrier why because the choices of the surfactants in the face wash are very friendly in order not to strip the skin off its moisture then we have introduction to facial serums and the facial serums that you're going to be introduced with in your facial product course are the two uh, main though there are up to three now also but the two main um chemical exfoliating uh, uh products the lactic acid and um, the salicylic acid meaning you're going to be introduced to serums exfoliating serums actually that will have aha and bha so on top of serums we're talking about something like this even though personally i do not sell my serums this is a serum i do not sell i don't know if you can see it personally i do not sell my serums in dropper bottles this one is just a sample i sell them here this is where i keep my put my serums yeah i do not have any serum in a dropper bottle yeah this is my serum uh oh you can see it. so that is it right so personally i do not put serums in dropper bottles and then um last but not least the last facial product you're learning in your facial product course if you're registering is the micellar water this is micellar water so you're learning micellar water and you're learning face wash therefore you're benefiting from surfactant potency course so surfactant so potency course shows up in uh products that has to do with washing with foaming do you understand so basically that is the uh, about facial product courses i hope i have made this very clear and it's very very understandable don't forget to subscribe if you like what you see here i'm not going to force you to subscribe but if you want to subscribe do it on your own terms and then also drop comment in the comment section and hope to see you in another video soon